I have fought against white domination and I have fought against black domination. I have buried the idea of a democratic and free society in which all persons live together in harmony. We have turned Mandela over to the South African security branch. We gave them every detail, what he would be wearing, the time of day, just where he would be. Mm -hmm. While Obama referenced the Kennedy administration in his memorial, he made no mention of the multiple reports that the CIA under Kennedy tipped off the late uh, the apartheid South African regime in 1962 about Mandela's whereabouts. In 1990, the Cox News Service quoted a former U.S. official saying that within hours after Mandela's arrest, a senior CIA operative named Paul Echo admitted the agency's involvement. Echo was, was reported as having told the official, quote, we have turned Mandela over to the South African security branch. We gave them every detail, what he would be wearing, the time of day, just where he would be. They have picked him up. It is one of our greatest coups. Yeah, so uh, Obama, <clears throat> when he went to the memorial... Maybe instead of taking a selfie, you could have given an apology. His struggle was your struggle. His triumph was your triumph. Your dignity and your hope found expression in his life and your freedom, your democracy is his cherished legacy. The issues and the controversy a thousand people have gathered at the City College of New York for a town meeting with Nelson Mandela. Mr. Mandela, you're participating in what is a very old and honorable American tradition, the town meeting. And rather than waste any time with my questions, if they don't ask you good ones, I promise I will try to. Those of us who share your struggle for human rights and against apartheid have been somewhat disappointed by the models of human rights that you have held up since being released in jail. You've met over the last six months three times with Yasser Arafat. Are these your models of leaders of human rights? And if so, would you want a Gaddafi or an Arafat or a Castro to be a future president of South Africa? One of the mistakes which some political analysts make is to think that their enemies should be our enemies. Our attitude towards any country is determined by the attitude of that country to our struggle. Yasser Arafat, Colonel Gaddafi, Fidel Castro, support our struggle to the hilt. They do not support it only in rhetoric. They are placing resources at our disposal for us to win this fight. People of every race and every walk of life, the world thanks you for sharing Nelson Mandela with us. That is the position. So particularly proud to be admitted to the ranks of honorary alumni of this university. And on a very personal level, to be accorded that honor together with a woman who occupies a special place in my life and an even
and an even more special one in my esteem, makes of this an uniquely privileged and appreciated occasion. I should add that it is my experience that the woman I am referring to so often steals my thunder. <laughs> and out, outperforms me that I must thank the university most sincerely for on this one occasion suggesting to her that I may be her equal. Uh, this is, apart from all other dimensions, a very important contribution to bringing equality to our morals. <laughs>